Good morning, man. What's mobbing, y'all? Hope y'all having a blessed day out there. Um, man, just was uh, vibing in the Word this morning for daily scripture on, on a little Bible app I'll be rocking with. Uh, Psalms 4, 8. It says, In peace I will both lie down and sleep for you, O Lord, alone. Make me dwell in safety. And um, the, the scripture really touched me because I spent so many years of my life um you know not not having no peace you know I, I know what it's like to lay up all night anxiety attacks you feel what i'm saying just uh tossing and turning you know just being in in just even regular situations and just having that that sinking feeling in the pit of your stomach you know what i'm saying just uh feeling like you always being tormented and always just being plagued and i noticed that the more i disconnected you know, from the, the, the cares of this life, the things of this life. And I really tried to do my best to um, pursue a, a true intimate relationship with God and and really also just seeking that humble posture before him, man. Like, you know, I, I'm whatever control I might even think that I have in this life is, is all an illusion, man. You know what I'm saying? Like God really does hold us all in his hand, man. And he really does, um, you know, call the end from the beginning. And, um, you know, I, and the more I, I realized that, but then also I had to also look at his character and how good and gracious and loving and, and he's always been, you know, not just to me, man, but to, to all people, even those who reject him, you know what I'm saying? He still lets them, you know, enjoy things in this life for a season. Um, it, 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 it really helped me to kind of like just relax and rest, man, in him. And so, you know, that's that's what that scripture is really talking about. It's talking about in in God, you know, um, knowing who he is and knowing his ability to keep us safe and putting our faith and trust in that. It allows us not just to lie down, you know what I'm saying, um, but 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 to sleep in in peace because everybody lies down, man. Everybody, you know, sleeps at some point. But how many people really are able to, you know, do these things with peace? You feel me? How many people are really walking through life with a genuine sense of peace and security and fulfillment? You know what I'm saying? And so, um, you know, when I just read how the psalmist just acknowledged that his ability to do that is not because his bag is straight. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's not because he's in good health. You know, it's not because, you know, he, he got a big army or, you know, whatever the case may be, man. It's because he understands who God is and he also understands his relationship with God and the fact that as long as he is in God's care, no matter what may come, the Lord is going to give him the strength to endure it. And also, man, he's going to give him, you know what I'm saying, the peace uh, to be able to rest, you know, in the midst of adversity. And so I just want to encourage y'all with that today. Um, you know, be blessed, man. Um, you know, continue to strive to keep Christ your first love. And if he's not, I would encourage you to make him your first love. You know, look at whatever it is that you're pursuing and then look at him. And I promise you, man, that whatever you chasing ain't, ain't going to love you like he does. And it ain't going to be able to do for you what he can do for you. You know what I'm saying? He changes us from the inside out. And a lot of the things that we chasing are, are external things. You know what I'm saying? So um, love y'all, man. Pray y'all have a blessed day. Um, a gang of people been asking uh, about, you know, these 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 hats that we just got in. You can go to the website, man, and, and grab them. And also just keep our brothers in prayer. Um, we sending a lot of brothers out across the country, man, to, to different communities and different places that really have a need for the type of ministry that we do. You know what I'm saying? Um, and so uh, I just want to give a special shout out to all the people who've been supporting us to be able to do that. Like, you know, not I'm not even going to speak on how everybody else move i just know how we move like we not charging for this stuff like that you feel me we 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 don't we don't tax people to come preach the gospel you know and, and i would say 90 percent of the time um 100 percent of the finances that it takes to get out here across these country and do ministry it comes out of our pockets you feel what i'm saying like we really not moving like most people move just simply because i understand that um where the need is usually is in a place of poverty 
and I know that a lot of people and a lot of even churches can't really afford, you know what I'm saying, right, especially in this season, to have people like us pull up and do these events and stuff. So, you know, I've tried to do my best to take that burden on my shoulders and, and the ministry. We've all tried to kind of take that burden on our shoulders, you know, to be able to get out here, man, and just be a blessing to people with little to no cost, you know what I'm saying, um, as the Lord leads and as the Lord allows. And all of you out there who are, you know, joining our Patreon, or just, you know what I'm saying, tapping in with the cash app and stuff like that. You guys are sponsoring plane tickets. You guys are sponsoring hotel rooms for brothers that's really out here in the field, you know, trying to reach the lost man. And I just want to salute y'all for that um, because we are all in this together. And if it wasn't for y'all, we really wouldn't be able to move um, the way that we're moving in a lot of cases. So, you know, um, salute to the body of Christ, man, for, for their help, you know what I'm saying, um, and, and getting out here with us, and anybody who wants to be involved in that, and, and help us, help send us, you know, where God leads us to go, you know what I'm saying, you can join our Patreon, the link's in the description, you know, our cash app's in the description, and, and every single dime, man, it goes to getting out here in these streets, and preaching the gospel, man, you know what I'm saying, going up into these communities, and fellowships of other believers, and being able to encourage them, and educate them, and edify them, man, so that they can get out, and be all that God has called them to be as well, so, you know, love y'all, man, and I appreciate y'all, uh, and just keep mobbing, man, in Jesus' name.